welcome back to the introvert circus i'm back with another adventure blog this time we took sirius out to the beach for a day trip last weekend and i got some video footage that i definitely of course wanted to share before we get started please don't forget to like and subscribe to the channel if you haven't already done so really really helps to help me build this channel for you to subscribe and it means you'll know every time i upload a video so we started our day trip obviously with a starbucks run sirius got her puppet she know she's very excited about that and we hit the road and headed out to the coast it was absolutely beautiful weather we had such an amazing amazing time um blue skies warm the water was actually relatively warm which you know from a global warming perspective is kind of scary for the oregon coast but it was really beautiful we had so much fun sirius found this great stick early on which we played with basically all day i don't like to bring any of our retrieving toys to the beach to play with um out of risk that they'll get swept into the tide and lost so whoop, got a little worried about that big wave uh so when we play at the beach i do like to use driftwood and things which serious if you know anything about my little branch manager she is perfectly happy to play with as well so it was such a beautiful day and one thing i just love about the oregon coast is how uh, wide it is and that we're able to get so much space to just be on our own and do our own thing we had so much fun here we were doing some some tricky games in the water it was a little bit too deep we had so much fun um, for her to do an orbit though so I did retried that orbit in a little bit shallower water this is what trick dogs do when we go to the beach clearly uh let me know in the comments if you and your dogs have any done any fun tricks anywhere uh unique this was definitely a fun fun spot to work on that so these are just some video clips of Sirius hanging out in the water she's grown so much in terms of her confidence with water i remember when she was a puppy and even a young adolescent uh, on the east coast she was definitely a little more wary about waves and she's gotten much more confident playing in them so that's been really fun to see how at four and a half how she really is continuing to grow and develop and mature um and it was just such a beautiful day she was looking for her looking for her sticko gonna go get it right through those wavies uh, and obviously we're super careful we don't go deep here and we stay um very close to shore for safety reasons um the oregon coast is definitely one of those beach spaces where there's lots of sneaker waves big waves um strong tides all that good stuff so we like to be really careful and thoughtful about where we're playing and where we allow Sirius to play but it was just such a gorgeous day um and she we found some really great spots where the tides were she was able to just swim which is obviously her favorite thing and it was so 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 much fun um and warm i think i said that but it was warm that bears repeating again because so unusual at the oregon coast uh it was great though and sirius was in her element i love these little video clips where she's actually riding the little waves uh as she's swimming so 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 cute so yeah this is one of my favorite places it is um yeah one of my favorite places to take serious we just had such a great day and it was so nice to be able just to get away you can see her there building so much confidence riding those waves cutting through them getting her stick bringing it back in and we just had such an amazing amazing day i didn't take a ton of video but um definitely did some video playing in the water because how could i resist we had too much fun not to but um I forgot my water camera because it had been having issues so it was working really well so she was trying to figure out where her stick is once you see when she figures out where it is then she just moves in on that stick um but yeah i took some footage that i wanted to just turn into a little vlog because i think it's fun one of my favorite things to watch on youtube always is dogs having a great time going on adventures doing fun things so that's something i enjoy bringing to this channel um i am doing a bunch of fun stuff though i know i've been talking about that we're going to do some product reviews we're going to do some training tutorials things like that if you have video requests things you'd like to see things you'd like to see more of things you'd like to see less of any of that stuff please let me know in the comments i'm always excited to get your feedback um and learn more about what kind of content you enjoy and what you and your dogs are up to but i love sharing the adventures that we get to take serious on 
um, in these videos and getting to just document some of those fun things. The Oregon coast is just so beautiful, so, so, so dog friendly. And it was great to get out there with her. Um, was excited that most of the dogs we saw were following leash law and were leashed, which was great. Um, there were a few that weren't, a few that weren't that didn't have great recalls. That was a real bummer. Please leash your dog. Please follow leash laws. It makes everything safer and more enjoyable for everybody. Um, but on the whole, it was really, really great. And I would say we have so, such a beautiful place to go. I feel so grateful that um, this beautiful paradise location is just under two hours away from Portland, which is amazing. So yeah, this was some beach swimming. We spent the whole day out there. We just went out for a day trip. We didn't stay in a hotel this time. Uh, so we left early in the morning, spent the day at the beach, mostly in the water. We also had a little camp that you'll see with our lounge chairs and just getting to hang out in the sand. I think I read like three magazines, which was amazing. Sirius took some naps. I love that she looks like a baby hippo and she's just like bobbing in the water. It was so, so, so clear that day too, which was amazing. I wish I had brought my underwater camera because I feel like it actually would have been clear enough that I could have gotten some great um, footage of her there and just making sure our long line isn't tangled or rather untangling her long line. Uh, that is always a little bit of the problem with swimming on a long line, though it is definitely my preference. Um, you just have to make sure that the line doesn't get tangled. It helps a lot using this um, back clip harness. It's a rough wear harness. I really, really like it. I always just leave it out. I've gotten questions about how it dries. It dries really well. Um, when we get home, I just put it out on our back patio, let it air dry, and it's good to go. Um, here we are. You can see Sirius is bringing her stick all the way back up the beach towards our um, beach chairs and where we have our little camp for the day. She was so proud of her stick. She was just carrying it all the way back. And I just think it's so cute um, to watch her. A little, little happy trail up the beach while she has her stick in her mouth. She definitely takes her branch managing duties very seriously, even if we are on vacation. Um, she always has to know where that stick is and carry it all the way. It was such a good day. Sirius was such a good girl. It was just so fun. I love being able to bring her on adventures like this. It's, you know, I know I've said it before. It's one of my absolute favorite things is to be able to give my dog such a big world and a rich world. It's something I've always loved to do with my dogs. And Sirius just has so much fun. The beach is one of her most favorite places. She definitely gets excited when she knows that's where we are heading. Um, and so she brings her stick all the way back. When we were out there, we also did do some trick practice, some rally practice. I always love practicing in new environments. So you can see a little bit of that here. Um, just getting getting some trick practice in for um, some routines we're working on. And it was so beautiful out, like how could we not? So I just set up my phone, took a little bit of recording of her practicing some orbits, we did some bows. I think we tried to do some leg weaves, which might have gotten a little a little messy with um, the long line. That was definitely on me. Um, definitely need to be a little careful with what tricks you're working on. Oh, we were just doing orbits, we did a lot of orbits. That's her favorite trick if you are new here. You might not know, she absolutely loves to throw an orbit. Oh yeah, I do try to do some some legs and she's like, mm, I'm on a long line. This is gonna get tangly. And it, it got a little tangly. Um, but yeah, there we go. Yeah, yay. So not a trick that's easy to do on a long line, but we did a couple repetitions there and then we worked on some bounces. It's just so pretty with the sky and the sounds of the ocean and the sand. Definitely a favorite spot. And we did some, a little bit of healing practice. I think in this, oh, maybe not in this clip, we did some recall practice and things. Yeah, shake off that sand. So it was such a great day. We were, like I said, we were up there basically all day. We left the house early in the morning, drove out to the beach um, and spent, I think eight or nine hours 
on the beach just hanging out and it was so 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 much fun you can see here we are walking back and uh, we got a puppuccino for the drive home um so you know it was a two puppuccino kind of day i hope you enjoyed today's video again don't forget to like and subscribe and i hope that you and your dogs are having a ton of fun and i will see you in another video very soon Bye bye